Morning, Jane. Morning. How are you today? Not doing too bad, I suppose. Nothing unexpected so far. It's also the employer's duty to make sure all staff are informed yeah, about first aid arrangements in the home. Yep, just checking but what exactly day. is first aid? And what is classed as a first aid emergency? They can happen to anyone, anywhere and at any time. And often when you are least expecting them. John. What will you do? Hazards can also be as simple as an object John. you or the casualty might trip John. over. Okay. Can you call Helen, please? We need first aid help now. Is he okay? John's not breathing. We need to call an ambulance. Go and call 999. Okay. Hello, ambulance, please. Yes, I'm at Castlebrook Care Home. The address is 10 Warren Drive. We have a 75-year-old male who I witnessed collapse. He's unconscious. The person calling for the ambulance yes. needs to state the casualty is unconscious and isn't breathing. Can you tell me how long it's going to be? They also need to find out how long the ambulance will be. OK, I'll stay on the line. And should remain on the phone until the ambulance arrives. If you have been involved in or witnessed a first aid emergency, you may need to seek support. Your employer should have measures put in place to provide this. Try not to leave a member of staff, witness or casualty alone following the incident. This is when they are at their most vulnerable. Also, be sensitive to the way different people react to incidents. Even if you are not a trained first aider, taking the actions we have shown is better than taking no action at all. It could mean saving feeling? someone's life. Thank you. It's good to have you back.